everyone, and thanks for joining us today. My name is Jeff Hatzel. I'm a Senior Application Specialist at Blue Marble Geographics. Today, we're going to take a look at the GeoCalc Geodetic Registry. This online repository is used by all of our applications and contains the complete GeoCalc library. It is regularly updated and current with the IOGP's EPSG Geomatic Registry as well. This ensures users can find accurate, up-to-date information on any supported geodetic objects. On the home page, we'll see the quick map search on the center of our screen. This is an easy way to zoom into a region, select a point of interest, and conduct a search based on that area. We'll see the resulting information for my search uh, from the state of Florida in the U.S. shows a variety of objects that are valid for the region. We can see geodetic coordinate systems, uh, datum transformations valid for the area, and much, much more. Sometimes it might be necessary to refine our search a bit more so that I can search for something a bit more specific. In that case, I would use the search panel on the left-hand side here. So I'm going to search for state plane coordinate systems, which are just coordinate systems unique to given states in the U.S., my search result is going to show us both area of use objects and projected coordinate system objects. I may not have any use for these area of use results in this specific search, so what I can do is refine my search even more. On the left hand side here I'm going to choose only to show me projected systems. When I do this and re-execute my search my results will be updated just to show projected coordinate systems here. Now I have a large list here because I have my default per page set to 50, but you can adjust that to any value you'd like. Now once I find my system of interest, I can click on it to find more details. Here I can see a variety of information, uh, such as my projection and associated parameters. So I can see this is a transverse Mercator projection. I could do the same for the base geodetic and dive into any of those settings that I'd like as well. You might notice that I'm signed into the GeoCalc uh, geodetic registry here. Anyone can do that using their Blue Marble account, and that gives us a little bit more functionality. So I can do things such as find the necessary URL that will direct me right to this uh, object. So this makes it much easier to share things between colleagues uh, or with clients, however we need to share our data. It also gives me the option to navigate directly to the GML or WK, WKT text that defines this string. This allows me to see that in more detail. So I hope this has been a useful introduction uh, to the GeoCalc Geodetic Registry. Please feel free to contact us with any questions. We're working hard on adding even more functionality to this registry, so stay tuned for updates.